Today I'd like to talk about how a virtual office is different from a virtual mailbox. Let's start by defining what a virtual office is. A virtual office gives businesses a physical address plus office-related services, such as a phone number, a receptionist, and meeting rooms to rent, just to name a few. On top of that, it's a brick and mortar office without the overhead. What are the pros of a virtual office? You'll have a lower overhead than renting a physical space, it's less management, and you'll have access to business amenities such as fax and internet. What are the cons? It's expensive, there's a lack of physical space, especially if you're traveling, you won't utilize it. What about a virtual mailbox? A virtual mailbox gives you a permanent address for receiving mail and packages. You can manage your mail easily, similar to email. Have your mail scanned, and once it's in your inbox, you can decide what to do with it. On top of that, there's other features that a virtual mailbox can be combined with, such as check depositing services. What are the pros of a virtual mailbox? It's affordable. It's extremely convenient. You can access your mail and packages anywhere you are in the world on any device, as long as you have internet. And there's a lot of features, as mentioned before, with check depositing services that you can combine with your virtual mailbox. Another example is you can do package forwarding or you can have registered agent services. What are the cons? The downside is you might incur additional costs to forward mail items compared to physically picking up your mail and packages. So what's the verdict? If you're looking for a permanent address and you don't need the physical space or a physical office, a virtual mailbox is your choice. It's best for those who run remote businesses and travel often. And there you have it. Overall, if you're looking for the most affordable and flexible option, the ultimate win goes to a virtual mailbox. Learn more.